What's up guys? Welcome back to another video. We are working on my car. I don't know if you guys have heard me, but I've been talking about putting a spiky strip on my car and probably a lot of you don't even know what a spiky strip is. Let me show you guys. Oh, so this is what I'm talking about. This guy right here. And if you guys look at it really closely, this thing's a piece of shit. <laughs> so this actually came off of Devin's Abandoned Evo. And I really wanted a spiky strip for my car, except for the one that I ordered didn't have this like curve at the end. So it didn't fit the roof of my car just because on all the Evo 10s, there's like this, uh, this curve right here. So it sits right here, like all the way from there to there on my Evo. And the one I ordered didn't have a curve in it, so I'm stealing Devin's. Ah! And we're gonna try to make this look okay. Oh, you found it, huh? Yeah. I had a special hiding place for it. What are you gonna do to fix it? So what we're gonna wanna do to really fix her up and make her really shiny is no zoom. No zoom. We're gonna have to sand her down a little bit. With what grit? Two. Two grit? Yeah. So you're gonna go outside to find two really big ass sharp rocks and just grind her down? That's what two grit would be like. Oh, I meant 200. Mm, I would start with 250, polish her off to 400-ish so you don't see the sand scratches. That's what I would do at least. And then once we're done with that, we're gonna put a fine, fine, expensive paint job on her. Expensive, eh? Yeah, like four buck. And then guys, we're gonna do a few more things for my car. I'm not really sure yet, but I really want to, so. We might do HODs in your highlights. Really? Maybe. This is probably the stupidest mod that will ever happen on this channel, but it has to be done. Really loud over there by the fire. Oh, okay, let's go. Does anybody know what this is? Take a guess. I know. I know you know. It's a blow off valve. Do you even know where it goes? Yeah, oh, my legs are sore from training with Jared. Nice plug. Cute little nook. Push oh. hard. I don't want to break it. Way too floppy, it's gonna Yeah, fall. we're gonna have to glue her in. Yep. Okay, so guys, I'm just gonna Spray this down with Dawn de Chopin water and then sand her down and get her nice and prepped for our paint job. Good, good talk. All right guys, I just got done sanding down the whole entire thing. And as you can tell, it's really ugly now. So now it's time to spray paint it. I'm known for spray painting things very well. On the bottom of the Vortex generator, apparently that's what it is, that's what Devin says it is, um, all of this old double-sided tape needs to come off. So I'm gonna get that off really quick. How many layers do we gotta do on this thing? Probably two or three. First one goes on light though. Okay, so in my professional spray painting past, we do the light coat first. I hope you guys can see me okay. So it's about 9.30 ish at night and Devin and I are literally starving. So I'm running into town really quick and buying us some pizza, maybe a few beers. I don't know, we're, we just, I don't know. We just need something right now. So let's go get some yummy pizza. So it's gonna be a really late night tonight, guys. Devin is wrapping his hood on his Evo. It's already like almost 11 o'clock at night right now and so that's kind of why I went to the store and got some stuff for us. This is literally the perfect late night snack. And then guys, we put in like, we put like five or six layers on this guy and look how good it turned out. 
It's getting pretty laid out. Devin is not finished with his hood yet. Basically, this thing is still drying and we're gonna leave it overnight, which I think is a better option, just to leave it drying overnight. Yeah, you know, we're just really gonna stock up this fire and just get a crank in. Guys, I'm extremely tired and I need to go to sleep. So I will see you in the morning. Yep. Got gotcha. you. Here you go. Oh, thanks. You're welcome. Hello, boys. It is officially the next morning. Happy Thanksgiving to everybody because because it's Thanksgiving. Oh. Let's see, how is she doing? Nice. We are back at the shop. We're gonna put this on my car. We just put it on top to see what it'd look like and you know, it just adds a lot of detail. We're gonna put double-sided tape on it and then stick her on. You want help? Yeah, I suck. Ugh, that noise is gross. But from here. Hmm. We got my spiky strip on the car and well the generator vortex on the car and for some reason it's just not fitting as well as we hoped it would so we got it on there and guys, it's just kind of a shit show because it's not lining up in a few places, which is weird because it's an OEM um, vortex. I'm just gonna leave it on there until it just gets looking worse. I know that sounds so ghetto, but I really like the way they look and from far away it looks good, but when you get up close, it looks pretty, pretty ratch. It looks pretty bad. So um, I'm gonna just leave it on there for now. I'll show you guys when I get to my dad's shop. I'm gonna clean my car. It's a disaster. So I'm gonna switch this to the GoPro and we're just gonna um, kind of go on a cruise and just like have fun. So um, let me switch to the GoPro. So I'm gonna show you guys the vortex generator and how it looks. It looks fine. It's not the worst thing in the world, but if you look right here, this side is like way bigger than this side. 
it just doesn't line up right. Like I feel like this side should be bigger than this side, if that makes sense. So there's like this big gap right here. And then Devin, Devin had to shave this down himself so it would actually fit around this piece. So that's a little bit wonky. And then over here, this actually fits really nice right here. But um, over here, if you guys can see this like little gap, we brought out the heat gun and it ended up, it ended up melting the paint right there. So if you're, if you look at it from further away, it looks fine. It looks good from far away. So Devin was like, just take it off, um, buy a new one. So I'm like, I'll just wait until it looks really bad and then I'll just take it off and buy a new one. Cause we spent all that time doing it for nothing. I wasn't about ready to take that off. So yeah, it looks pretty good. Um, <clears throat> Rose hasn't gotten a bath in probably two, probably like a month. So it was, my car was really dirty, but I'm going to clean the inside of it and then I'll kind of show you what it looks like in the inside. I showed you guys the inside of my car before, but I just cleaned it all out. So I need to, I would really like to replace that floor mat. It's a little, little rough, but yeah. Anyways, guys, it's really nice and clean in here. Um, pretty much just stock for the most part, except for the radio in here and the gauges up there. And yeah, we have the Recaro seats. They're in really good condition. So everything's nice and clean in here. Okay guys, so the car is nice and clean. I finally got the Vortex on. We were supposed to kind of do LED headlights in this car, but Devin and I ran out of time just because it's Thanksgiving and I have to get to my family's house to um, enjoy each other, you know? So I'm gonna end this video here. I There's gonna be a lot more Evo content coming out. Um, I don't know if you guys have heard, but later this winter we're gonna be doing a big turbo on my car. So I'm super excited for that. It's gonna be so much fun. Thank you so much for following this video. And if you wanna see more of these, remember to hit that like button, remember to hit that subscribe button if you haven't already, and I will see you in the next video. Bye.